gestational diabetes means the carbohydrate intolerance which is first recognized during pregnancy. The incidence in general population is between 9 to 13 percent and it is the most common metabolic disturbance which is seen. How we can diagnose is first we have to screen out the high risk factors in a population given to us in the pregnant women. If the lady is having more than 25 years of age, BMI is more than 25, if there is history of diabetes in the family, if there is history of PCOS or abnormal uterine bleeding to the patient itself, or if she has history of stillbirth or recurrent miscarriages, or if she is having passing the sugar level of more than 125 at a given point of time, then she is at poor risk of developing the GDM. The fetal complications could be the very large baby, which could be more than 4 kg in the body weight, and chances of the Edgar score going less than 7. There is chance of hypercalcemia, hypomagnesemia, and hyperbilirubinemia to the baby itself. So, how we can prevent this gestational diabetes is basically by changing the diet and lifestyle. The diet should be less than 20 to 25 kilocalorie per kg body weight and with the carbohydrate intake only keeping it to 50% of the whole nutrition they are taking in a day. Exercise we stress upon by that the patient should be doing brisk walk after every meal for almost 20 minutes that regulates the sugar level. Third thing is medications. Medications are given when there is uncontrolled sugar levels and that has to be regularly monitored along with the sugar levels. So patient has to be taken care of very well and a bit about the oral care and the foot care which is very much prone to develop infections in pregnancy in diabetics. We take a pledge, we'll treat you well.